This is a tippy tap. Cool, right? Press your foot on a plank to wash your dirty hands when you come back from the shop. A handy soap on a rope will get rid of the virus as long as you soap up properly for 20 seconds. Then press the plank again to rinse and you don't have to worry about cleaning any tap handles. Easy, now join me in making one. <laughs> what do you need? An empty 2 liter bottle with a cap, a plank, some string to tie them together, a nail to make holes in the bottle, the bottle cap and the soap, a candle to heat up the nail, a lighter or matches to light the candle, some pliers to hold the hot nail, some wire to tie your bottle to a tree or a pole, and a bar of soap for your soap on a rope. It's important to measure where to put the hole where the water will come out so that it's quite close to the cap of the bottle, about one finger away. Now hit up your nail to make the hole. You need to have patience, it can take a while to get hot. Once it's nice and hot, push it firmly through the plastic. Yay! <laughs> now that's the hole where your water will come out. Now we're going to make the hole to tie the string that goes to the plank. You make that hole in the bottle cap. Make sure your nail is nice and hot. So if your hole for the water is here, you need to add two more holes on the opposite side to tie your bottle to the tree. The bottle will tip on the wire that goes through these holes, so it's important that you get the position right so that the water will come out right. Mm. Go ahead and make these two holes with your hot nail. Wiggle it a bit to make the holes bigger if you are using a thick wire. Now push the wire through and make sure there's enough wire to tie to the tree. Next, we're going to attach the string to the bottle cap. Measure about 2 meters of string. You can always cut it if it's too long later. Push the string through the cap and make a nice big knot on the inside. Pull the string through and make sure your knot is holding. You'll be pulling this knot when you press your foot on the plank. So tie the other end of the string to the plank. Use the nail again to make a hole in the soap. You know, then tie a string to the nail and press it through. Now you can make a knot underneath the soap to make your soap on a rope. Check that your knot is big enough to hold the soap in place. Now we've made the tippy tap. That's your bottle, check, your plank, check, and your soap on a rope. I'm sure you can't believe it was so easy to make. Now let's go and install it. Find a handy tree and tie the wire around it. Don't forget to fill your bottle with water. Make sure your plank is at the right distance. Adjust the string length if needed so you can reach the water when you press with your foot. If you have one of these bottles, you only need two holes, one in front for the water to come out and one in the cap for the string. Everybody loves the tippy tap. Make sure you tie the soap on a rope to the tree. Then everyone can soap up for 20 seconds. Use the soap. Very good. Very good. It's a good idea. Why don't you make a few of these and give them to your other community members? Contact the Roads Community Engagement Office if you've made a tippy tap to give away.